boys. They all turned away except him. Back up so we can see what you're wearing. And they're all wearing jeans and a Christmas sweater. And then Miss Isabella is right here. If I can get her over here. Isabella! If I can get it to where she is. That's the color of her dress. I showed y'all it already. Can you see? I hope you can see. And then there's Santa. Over there. Can you say hi? So, that is my boys. Look, she's waving to Santa. She, I brought her, this is the hint. If you are coming to see Santa, come earlier in the month and you go up there when nobody's here and just let them talk to Santa. And then when you come for the picture, she'll really like being with Santa. She's wanting because she wants to go by Santa right now. So, and that is a huge tip for babies that, or kids that are afraid of Santa because then they can come say hello and, you know, get to know Santa on a personal level and you're not just sitting them up there with a um, stranger so there you go there's a sample hint we will see y'all and I'll show you the picture after it gets taken I am going to do some last minute Christmas shopping you saw us earlier get pictures done with Santa and I will have inserted a picture already of that and now I dropped off the kids with my husband and they are playing basketball and doing some other game stuff while I go do some last minute Christmas shopping because I will be having Troy he is going to be with us for Christmas, and I was not expecting it, but I am very happy to have him, and yeah, so, um, I look a hot mess, because I just didn't care, I was just like all about the kids today, but that's okay, um, and we took a nap already too, so went home and took a nap after that because we also went to Kohl's and all that with the kids that had returned something that didn't fit Isabella and then I had to go return something that didn't fit the boys at Dillard's and I went to Dick's and got me a pair of shoes because I don't have a I didn't have a pair of tennis shoes and it's cold outside so mommy needed a new pair of shoes they were $30 and for some Nikes that's a great price and that is my budget for myself of course I buy my kids the hundred dollar shoes and I buy me the thirty dollar shoes you know how it goes mom life right so I am going to Walmart right now to get some things just some last-minute Christmas shopping for the kids and Carson is going with my mom. They're going to Northeast Louisiana for Christmas, which is really sad, but that's okay. I know that um, he'll have fun out there with my mom and his fan and their fit in that family. So, my mom's family. Um, I just, you know, I'm used to having him all the time with us, so it's just about to go in Walmart and get the rest of everything that I need done. I need diapers, I need to get the Christmas food that I'm gonna get as far as like what I'm making for Christmas. I'm just gonna do the same thing I did for Thanksgiving and yeah, and call it a day. So I will see y'all when I get out and I'll show you what I got when I am done. I will not show any kind of Christmas presents because my kids do watch my videos so I just you know don't want to run the surprise for my babies therefore 
I will not be showing that stuff, but on Christmas Day, I will record what we got our kids and the different things that we got them and the stuff that Santa brings to them, I will show you. And just so you know, we don't buy things throughout the year for our children unless it's something like a pair of pants that they need, you know, clothes we buy for our kids that they need, you know, for school and to wear. We buy one pair of shoes in the beginning of the year and let, and we'll buy another one if we need it to, you know, something like that. But we don't buy like throughout the year for our kids, just birthday, Christmas, and then they get a little something for Easter, like in their Easter basket. But other than that, we don't buy like extravagant toys or anything like that for our kids during the year so for Christmas is the time that we get to spoil them and um, and I, I don't think that we go crazy at all um, we do have a budget and we stick to that budget every year um, and like I said whenever Christmas comes I will share all that with y'all and show you what Santa brought and what we got them um, and yeah so I will show y'all what I get as far as groceries and all that good stuff for when I get out of here so I'll see y'all in a little bit hey guys this is Anna we're back from Walmart and oh my goodness I was in there entirely too long I was in there for at least two hours or if not longer it was crazy so let's get into the haul and what I got like I said I'm not showing any Christmas presents that will be showed on Christmas Day but we got some milk I got some diapers I get the Huggies little movers but I do like the Huggy Supreme better and it's in a red bag and I'll, even better than those I like the Baby Genix but they don't sell it they only sell it at Target around us and we don't have a Target so I have to drive like 30 minutes to an hour to get to a Target so we get these <laughs> um we got some elbow macaroni for macaroni and cheese I got two things are puppy cleansed. I got the regular just paper liners, the white, and I got the gold full liners. And this comes with 48 and this comes with 96. I got this thing of homestyle gravy classic chicken and like I say before I mix this with the drippings from the turkey or I just make my own gravy and just add a little flour to the drippings of the turkey. I don't know which one I'm doing yet, but I just bought it just in case I want it. We got five pound bag of apples, and that's for a gag gift. A thing of whites, and I just get these Parent Choice uh, Sensitive with Soothing Aloe Baby Wipes. They good for us. Wipe good. Don't leave a, re leave a residue. Um, some parsley. Some more bagels. I had, we got a half a pack left, so I went in and got some more. I don't know if I showed you the haul where I bought two things of it. This is a whole chicken. This is a whole chicken in there. And that was six dollars. Let's see. I bought three bags of this to go for tonight. My mother-in-law bought some ribs from the farmer's market. So we are going to have this with the ribs tonight. We got some celery, which my little one already got into. And I got, I think, three cans of cream of chicken, a can of cream of celery, one can of cream of mushroom, and two cans of golden mushroom. I got some just sliced carrots for the kids just to have or whatever and some cut green beans we got some queso blanco dip I like this one my husband likes the other one from Trader Joe's um 
I got some sugary cereals for the kids for the holiday. We got Lucky Charms and Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Those are like the sugar cereals that I'll buy every now and then for them. Some Aunt Jemama Original Syrup. Sara Lee Honey Wheat Bread and Sara Lee Artisanal Bread. This is our turkey. It is the butterball. I have to leave it out because it is frozen and I hope it defrosts in time. And I got two things of Cokes. And I think that is it that I can show you right now. And like I said, I was in there for at least two hours, if not longer. And I forgot to show you this. I'm not sure if I showed y'all this when I went to Sam's the other day. We got this and I gave a gallon size full bag of, to my mom and the kids um, are just devouring them. They love them. So Isabella loves them. Everybody loves them. It's just a good, cheap, quick snack for the kids that isn't so bad for them. So I will, that is going to be a repeat buy for me when we do run out. Um, let's see. And I think that was it. That's all I got today. Oh, here we go. Lay's Kettle Cooked Barbecue Chips. That was one other thing. And some honey mustard. That was another thing. And other than that, that is it for us today. I will show you when we eat what we're having. And then that will be the rest of our day. Huh. So it's been a long day or a good day. So thanks. We'll see y'all in a little bit. I almost forgot to show y'all what we were eating tonight. We're having ribs, the chicken rice, corn, and bread. And that's what we're having tonight. Thanks for watching, guys. Many blessings to you and your family during the Christmas season. I like Bye. Food.